There we go. There we go. High five. High five. High five. This is what it's all about. You know, getting a chance to come here with my foundation and get a chance to put on this camp with pro camps. It's this is this is what it's all about for me as a youth. You know, getting a chance to spend some time with with some future all stars and you know talk to them a little bit about baseball, school, life, and uh, hopefully they you know, have a smile on their face and learn something today. Oh man! Look at this! Look at this! Wow! I just want to say thank you for coming out. I want you guys to have a great time today, okay? I want you guys to bring your attitude, bring your A game, and let's have some fun, all right? Let's do it. Why do you catch the ball on your side instead of getting in front of it? Well, when you're in a hurry and you're trying to run, throw out a runner at a base, you know, usually I was taught, most of you guys were taught too, to kind of, you know, catch in the front. That's the standard way to do it. But when you're in a hurry and you got to make a throw on the run, for me, it's easier to kind of get you know, left leg in front and get this the glove out to the side. That way you can easily kind of come up, scoop it up, and make an accurate throw. Nice, that's a strike right there. Hey, that's too easy. Too easy. Hands ready, hands ready. Hands ready, hands ready. It's all up. You know, just seeing their smiles on their face and you know, I'm trying to talk to them about drills or give them instructions, but they're just, they want to ask me all these baseball questions or kind of starstruck. Yeah, you like, they hold it like this, I think. It's weird, right? It's pretty humbling for me, you know, to get out here and see that kind of reaction from them. He really identifies and he understands and he cares. It's not, it's not hard, it's just who he is. And that's, I think, what the most important key is for connecting to kids and then getting the support from the parents to help their child and to share the share what we're trying to do with so many kids. They're watching every single game, they're watching your every single move, what you say, and you know for me that just kind of puts it all in perspective. You know, being a role model, you gotta it's always about doing the right thing and just knowing that even though you think no one's watching or no one's listening, you know, there's always somebody out there, you know, a little kid, five year old, ten year old that's you know watching every move. So you gotta do, you know, do something special and do the right thing. Yeah, attitude for me, guys, is the number one thing, no matter what. But especially in baseball, school, um, anything you guys are doing, other sports, you got to have a good attitude because things aren't going to go your way. You're going to miss a shot. You're going to miss a pitch. You're going to strike out. But guess what? Life keeps going on. The game keeps going on. There was really not a day that Aaron said, hey, Mom, Dad, I want to do a foundation. As he was growing up and admired so many athletes across all um, areas of sports, he noticed that they were giving back. You know, I saw a lot of, you know, my favorite athletes always had foundations, they're always giving back. And then for me to be in this plus position and getting the chance to, you know, get drafted, play for the Yankees, you know, I just felt like it was the right thing to do. You know, give it, give a chance to give back, you know, to those less fortunate, those, you know, inspiring to be in my position or those, you know, wanting to do anything they want. You know, this is a good opportunity to help them along the way. And if I can change a kid's life or, you know, help them in any way, that's, you know, I think I made a difference. We actually have had conversation about this for a long time. And then we started throwing ideas around and then it became reality and it's been an evolution. And it's been such a fun, 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 exciting time. I gotta say, I looked around every single team. I saw a lot of teamwork. I saw a lot of smiles. I saw great attitudes. And that was the word of the day, right, was attitude. An event like this just helps us get the word out. And, and as you can see, the kids know Aaron and they know the All Rise. They know what he stands for. So what we do is we give three mini grants to the Bronx region, three to Fresno, and three to Linden every year for their programs that align with our mission, which is developing youth and children we're trying to be there to empower the youth to make good decisions, to find what the love of their life is, and to go for it. Once again, I just want to say thank you to you guys. Thank you to the coaches, parents, everybody. Thank you for coming out tonight. This is wonderful, so thank you.